You've probably heard of the Huawei P30 and P30 Pro, but the company has actually recently announced three phones, and this third one right here is the best value of the bunch. In the box, you get a USB Type-C cable, you get an 18 watt fast charger, as well as a pair of earphones. So that phone in question is the Huawei P30 Lite. It's a very different kind of proposition to the other two phones in the range, but at the same time, no less surprising. Where it gets interesting is pricing. You can get this phone for £329 in the UK, or around $320 in the US. And taking a look at the phone's exterior, you'll struggle to tell the difference with phones that are twice the price. It uses 3D curved glass, but is one of the slimmer, lighter phones to do so, coming in at 159 grams, which makes it an enjoyable balance of premium and being halfway to a compact phone. It's crafted for one-handed use, and I can confirm, at least for someone with slightly above average sized hands, that it is quite usable, even if you're using the other hand to carry something. There's also been a couple of good choices made when it comes to design. You've got chamfered edges on the top and the bottom, this flashy peacock blue colour scheme, which looks different in pretty much every lighting condition, as well as a headphone jack. It's also one of the cheapest phones in the world with a triple camera setup. But how are they managing to do this? First of all, the light comes with a 24 megapixel front camera. It's incredibly crisp with the right lighting. You can also take portrait mode shots like this one here, and there's a lot of stuff to do with augmented reality. Now, onto the back, and to start with, there's a 48 megapixel main camera, pretty much as high as it gets on any type of phone. You can probably imagine then, as long as you have good light, the detail is phenomenal, and the interesting thing about it is that this thing doubles as the zoom camera. It uses something called hypersampling lossless zoom, which uses the subtle movements of your hands when you're taking one of these shots to capture more information about your subject. The results do look better than if you were to just take a camera and use straight up digital zoom. You also get AI scene detection on the main camera, and you can probably imagine, I was giddy with excitement when I saw that this thing has night mode too. It's a feature that so far has been largely exclusive to flagship phones, and lets you take clear and bright shots in the dark. Safe to say it works nearly as well as my Galaxy S10 Plus in low light. That second camera is an 8 megapixel ultra wide, and it's got a 120 degree field of view, the same as the P30 Pro, so you're still able to capture a lot in one frame, and this lens still works with video too. And then you've got a 2 megapixel dedicated depth sensor, which assists in portrait mode. This should mean better edge detection and more natural background blur. Alright, so the P30 Lite is running MUI on the latest version of Android, and it's got a couple of cool software features. You can set a video instead of just a ringtone when you get called by certain contacts, and it comes with high vision, which allows you to translate text in augmented reality and in real time. Pretty cool. You'll be appreciating all this through its 6.15 inch LCD screen, which is not a highlight of the phone, but it's not bad, and the fact that it takes up nearly 85% of the phone's front lends it a modern touch. Let's take a look at some specs. The phone comes with 4 gigs of RAM paired with 128 gigs of expandable storage. It supports GPU Turbo 2.0 to stabilize gaming frame rates, and the whole operation is powered by the mid-range Kirin 710 chip. Long story short, this trades blows with its Snapdragon equivalents in terms of performance, which is to say you'll struggle to make it skip a beat in day-to-day -day tasks, and you shouldn't really have a problem with most games you find on the Play Store. In fact, Android games generally just don't need the most powerful chip to perform properly. It also has a pretty robust battery setup. Huawei has paired a 3340mAh cell with the 18 watt fast charging we mentioned earlier. It's enough that it's not a liability, you don't need to worry about this phone running out in a normal day. The Huawei P30 Lite will be available from the 10th of May here in the UK at pretty much all major retailers. If you enjoyed this video, it'd be massively appreciated if you could smash that subscribe button, and I'll catch you in the next one.